Ijaz Ahmed tried to do some damage control after humiliating himself by showing us his ignorance about the Shahada. Yesterday, he uploaded a new video to try to refute a Christian brother. Ijaz knows he made a grave mistake. Now he's trying to lie and deceive his own gullible audience to save face and his already destroyed Dawa career. Hello, damage control afterwards won't help you anymore. As you know, brothers and sisters, Muslim missionaries are very slippery and they will always try to deceive you when it comes to the Arabic part in a discussion. Ashadu. Ashadu. Anna. Anna. Muhammadan. 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 And after this video, I hope he can retake his correct Arabic shahada because remember, Allah only knows Arabic. Allah is daif, he doesn't know other languages. Now let me teach you guys how he's lying again. And here you can see for yourself how he humiliated himself once again. Just watch. Assalamu alaikum guys, you're in for a really funny one. It would have taken this Christian missionary who posted this video about me roughly three seconds to Google something and hear the recitation of the Quran and understand that he's actually quite wrong. But seeing that he is a missionary and he needs to be dishonest and unfortunately his viewers don't know any better, we just simply have to help educate them. So, you know, today I'm going to give some sadaqah. No, no, you're going to be the sadaqah today, Ijaz, and it's going to be your janaza. Uh, in a conversation, I told a Christian missionary, La ilaha illallah, Muhammadur Rasulullah. This recitation, when you say Muhammadur and you merge the Arab, you roll it, after the word Muhammad, this is even attested to in the Quran. Let's listen. Muhammadur Rasulullah. And so here we can even see that it's in the Quran and even Sheikh Asim al-Hakim speaks about this and says the same thing. Saying Muhammadur Rasulullah. Any Muslim knows that you can do this. Guys, did you notice something? He switched the goalpost and did not address his mistake in the Shahada. He did not address the problem at all. He simply created a straw man by going to a Quranic verse which has nothing to do with the actual Shahada. He never addressed or corrected his mistake. Do you see the mental gymnastics and deception of these Muslim da'is? I mean, deceivers? Ijaz Ahmed knows very well how to trick his own Muslim gullible audience. But he knows that he made a huge unforgivable mistake when he recited the Shahada in a wrong way and for that he got busted by the Christian brother in the original video. Now what Ijaz Ahmed did not include in his new video is the fact that the Shahada can only be found in the Hadith. The Shahada is certainly not in the Quran. So why did he go to chapter 48, ayah 29? To create a straw man and deceive his Muslim gullible audience, these poor victims. So let us go to the Hadith to expose him and teach him again the correct Arabic Shahada. This is Sahih Muslim, Hadith number 379. It says for that very specific part, Ashhadu anna Muhammadan Rasulullah. So as you see, Ijaz Ahmad doesn't know his Shahada. He must retake the Shahada correctly to become a Muslim. Ashhadu. Ashhadu anna. Anna. Muhammadan. 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 We say. Ashadu an la ilaha illallah wa dahu la sharika lahu wa ashadu anna Muhammadur Rasulullah. Muhammadan. Muhammadur. Muhammadan. Muhammadur. Now, do you understand how Ijaz Ahmad created a straw man fallacy by shifting the goalpost, going to the Quran while the Quran doesn't have the correct shahada? You must go to the hadith to learn about the shahada. Ijaz Ahmed, stop lying. You have no honor, you have no shame. You don't know your shahada. This is embarrassing. An Arabic-speaking Christian like me must teach you your Islamic shahada in Arabic. Now, do you understand why we always say without the lies of Muslim missionaries, Islam dies? I have a certificate from university in Arabic. It's Brother basic Rizullah. Arabic. It's not Al Rasul Allah. It's Rasul Yes, we can we can call him Al Rasul Allah. The Rasul of Allah. We have no problem with this. Come on. 
We say Muhammad al Rasulullah, Muhammad do Rasulullah. No, the definite articles included there, Muhammad do Rasulullah. No, it's not correct, it's Allah. Allah. It's not Al Rasul Allah, man. It's in the Adafa state. Okay. It doesn't have you, the definite article. You don't know. You don't know Arabic. You don't know Arabic. Can you like? Is there an example where you have a text that says that that has this statement where it's uh, where is you know uh, Al Rasul Allah? Brother Avery from God Logic Apologetics is asking for a specific example for the definite article Alif Lam for. El Rasul Allah. Where does it say El Rasul Allah? We say Ashadu an la ilaha illallah wa dahu la sharika lahu wa ashadu anna Muhammadur Rasul Allah. What happened to the example? Where is El Rasul Allah? <laughs> he only recited, as you heard, the wrong shahada again. We say Ashadu an la ilaha illallah wa dahu la sharika lahu wa ashadu anna muhammadur rasulullah